welcome back to Zulchoki episode 5. Um, when we last left off, we had traveled to Bambala and we're going to do some quests here. So let's get cracking. We are still on the hunt for Yuniku. Hey there. Oh. Priestess Hurala. Mandokia is alive, yes. You are responsible, yes. You may be able to stop him still, yes. To know Mandokir, you must see Mandokir. To see Mandokir, you must use eyes, eyes of Raptor. You formed a bond with Raptor. Ogan Aka, daughter of Ro of Ogan. To strengthen bond, we need feathers. You will go to, you will go west, and you will find feathers. Yes. Gentle stalker mm -hmm. feathers. Okay. Ah, uh, who lives up here? Sulkan. They say you have the heir of the throne. I, I do. I was sent here by, by Queen Talanji herself. But currently in the timeline, Queen Talanji is not a thing yet. It's King Rastakan. Uh, again, expansions are confusing. Huh. Are you? Troll sinks to himself and stares into the cauldron. He appears to be injured. You're I don't. Okay. Sure. Uh, Skeezy will talk to you later first. King Wile. Zanzil the outcast? If Yuniku is held by that troll, a vile and powerful witch doctor, then I fear that. Only a oh, faint hope remains, faint and tiny as the smallest insect. Fortunately, I have some suspicion of my own, suspicions which may lead to Yeniko's salvation. The mind's eye is held by an ogre mage in the Mosh Og Ogre Mounds, just to the south. His name is Mizoth. I know him from the uh, when the Dark Spears dwelt in Strangathorn. He is vicious and his magic is strong. And if he has the mind's eye, then his magic will be stronger still. You must face my, uh, my Zoth and wrest from him mind's eye. It is a perilous task, but it is the only hope we have of saving Yeniku. Okay, ogre hunting. Uh, now, where's Skeevy? Oh, over here. Skeezy, sorry. Hey, how you doing? Skeezy will zap. Hey, there's a lot of money out there in that jungle, Zandalari. Can you see it? No? It doesn't look like gold or copper. It looks like raptor highs and minerals, uh, mineral veins and ancient troll artifacts. Okay, maybe the mineral veins might look like gold or copper. But still, you get my point, right? The Marshawk Bounty. So have you heard about the ogres? I got a hot tip from some fella named Mokthardin that some Zandalai schmuck is uh, in a ridiculous druid getup found this ogre hand and... Um, what was I saying? Oh yes, some breathtaking heroin found this ogre hand and Mokthardin thinks it means the ogres have some special artifact. I've seen them guarding a chest up in some ruins behind their mound. Can you fetch it for me? Hey, have you been to Hard Wrench Hideaway yet? Oh, you've got to see it. It's everything a goblin could ever hope for. Tell you what, you look like a stand-up druid. Raksha in the vest and skirt over there can give you a ride if you don't already know the way. Flight's on me. Bye. I suppose we could go to Hard Wrench Hideaway. I'll accept it for now, but not sure. Let's have a quick look at the map. Right, jungle stalkers, and they're all over the place. Moshog. Well, let's uh, tend to the ogres first and then do the raptors on the way back. So, um, let's see. Is this hot? I don't know. Well, we're at the ogre mound, but I have yet to see any ogres. Oh! Fudging fudgers. I got spooked by you, kitty. Therefore, you have to die. 
There we go. Ah, oh, there we go. That's, uh... Right. Well, let's go stealth mode. We are a super sneaky kitty. And just sneak our way inside and go look for the ogre. A silver vein. You know, I should pick up a trade skill at some point on this character. Let's not mess with uh, that alliance who's busy murdering ogres in here. It's not important. Clip past behind the ogre mauler. Okay. And assassinate. Ah, uh, you easy. Oh no 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 no. I need to target something first. There we go. And then we sneak back out again. Ha! Ah, uh, that alliance fellow will have to wait. Because we got in there first. He's higher level, but that doesn't matter. We're a stealthy asshole and we can just sneak in and out. Okay, now there's apparently also something up above and behind the ogre mound. Well, well, well. Looks like... Oh. No, 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 no. Haha! -ha, we got it! Um, this appears to be a dead end. Okay, uh, never mind, we're heading this way! Okay, let's see. Um... Where do we go now? Well, I mean, we still have raptors to hunt, I suppose, but I want to be able to go back into stealth. There we go. You don't see me. Nope. Nothing to see there. I'm just slipping past. Okay. So to the south of here, there are apparently raptors. And there are raptors over that away. Let's first check south. I have the feeling that not every raptor will somehow give us good feathers. Well then. Charge! Oh no 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 no. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. Hey, Tithis! Tethis. not appear to be useful for us right now. I believe he's part of the nesting wary quest line where you have to hunt raptors at some point. But I'm not that concerned about the nesting wary quest line. The quests are efficient experience wise because they're mostly just kill quests which tends to be the most efficient forms just go here and kill a bunch of this but that's not a very exciting story, now is it? I do not have a target. Not like this, where we have a personal vendetta against Bloodlord Mandokir. I must get closer. Or where we uh, are trying to find a missing troll and have to deal with an evil witch doctor. Well, still, this is not hunting feathers is not very exciting either. So I'm gonna go and speed this up a little bit. And uh, you can see me trundle around casually looking for jungle stalkers. I'll see you back at the camp.
And we're back. Do I have a deal for you? Why is it that ogres always find the priceless artifacts? Yeah, those ogres really know how to close the treasure chest. I'll tell you what. A box is useless to me, my dear. We're going to need to find a way to get into this crate. A universal key. We're going to need something even stronger than those beefies under lorry hands of yours to open this. And the venture company schlubs in the northwest might have just a thing. Last time I was over there, I saw shredders walking around with giant rotating blades in their hands. That's one way to open a box. If you can't find any shredders, you might also try the giant saw blade in the lumber mill by the lake. Open the martial oak bounty by fighting a venture co shredder or using the saw blade in venture co lumber mill. Okay. Man, I hate the Venture Company. They have a string of operations through Stanglethorn which keeps hard-working goblins, like me, from making, an o from making honest gold. My way? Theft. The Venture Company geologists, uh, geologists near Lake Nesferiti to the northwest are deeply interested in those strange blue crystals they've been finding in the mines. Bring me samples of the stone from their geologists. I don't care what you have to do to get them. Have a good one. Okay. Uh, you have a quest, and you have a quest to turn in. How you doing, man? Greetings, Uchoki. The spirits sing praise of your bravery, yet they tell me no tales of your quest against my Zoth. Do you have the eye? You retreat the eye! Your might is the stuff of legend, Uchoki! And in getting the eye, you have defeated my Zoth and sent him to the Nether. That is why the spirits would not mention him before. It is good that he is gone from the world of flesh and bone, but now that he, uh, but now that he is in the realm of the spirits, I fear he may begin a new reign. But that is a worry for another time. Saving Yaniku, I've reshaped a mind's eye into a soul gem. Its purpose is twofold. You must use it to stun Yaniku, and once stunned, place it upon his head to entrap his soul. My suspicions that I spoke of earlier were correct. The spirits tell me that Yuniku dwells not with the Zan, uh, with Zanzil the Outcast, but within the ruins of Zul Mamwe, to the southwest. Once you freed Yuniku's spirit, return to Nimboya at Kromgol. See you later. Okay. I will talk to you in a moment. First, though. Don't be shy. A raptor named Organ Arka, still your friend. You bring feathers, yes? You can follow directions, yes. You have the feathers, yes? We have the druid, yes. Speak with priestess when you are ready. Later. I am ready for the mind vision ritual. Spirits be with you, man. Oh, wow. Oh, we are looking through. Welcome to Zuguru Glitter One. It might not look like much now, but give it time. Yeah. yeah. Skull. These are these are all level ninety elites. There's plenty of warriors left here, but I wouldn't worry about the competition. You're from the bloodline of Organ. My oldest friend. You see, our souls are intertwined, yours and mine. Here we are. Get ready for your training, little one. I recommend you forget about that worthless Zandalai druid and start thinking about your duties here in Zulgurub. Talk to me. What did Priestess tell you? The raptor is the daughter of Ogan, heir to Mandukir's seat. Mind vision is not enough, no. Mind control, much more powerful magic, yes? Powerful magic needs powerful reagents. Troll brain is a powerful reagent. Braddock in Zulmambe, very smart, yes. Head south and check out the big brain on Braddock. Bye bye now. 
Well, that's um, more headhunting, I guess. Wait, somebody else up here. Do you have a quest for us? Yes, you do. Do you want something? Zulmanwe Mambo. The skull splitters are an embarrassment to the Troll Empire. They are petty squabbles with the blood scabs have torn Northwestern Stranglethorn apart. A Northern Stranglethorn, sorry. Where tribes like Darkspear and Zandalai thrive, the skull splitters fight over ruins. I have been authorized to issue rewards to mercenaries who are willing to deliver punishment to the skull splitters. I encourage you and anyone you know to travel south to Zulmanwe and call their wayward tribe. Well, looks like it's time to go troll hunting. Some hot, tasty troll on troll violence. Whoop! What's beyond your mind? I may be of the dark. I may be of dark spear birth, but I spent my childhood here in Stranglethorn Vale. I have seen everything there is to see here in Stranglethorn, but most offensive is devastation that the venture company has done to the riverbed. To make things worse, Foreman Kozel and his crew have been increasing their activity, and I s suspect they have some new plan. Succeed where I have failed, Zulchoki. Kill Kozel, obtain his key, and steal the blueprints from his apartment. One year ago, my brother, that is the troll who took care of me, was taken by the skull splitters of Zul Mamwe. Young and headstrong, I, read in, I ran in after her. Wait. Oh, my mother, I said brother. Ah, there we go. I was confused, wasn't reading the text. Uh, let me continue where I left off. Yes. <clears throat> I ran in after, only to see her being pushed toward the burning brazier by a dozen, uh, by a dozen of their warriors. I hid behind the tree and watched as they grabbed her and... At night time, the lights from their braziers reflect off the treetops and keep me awake. Please, Ochoki. Travel south to Zul Mamwe and put them out. That, that got dark. Spirits. That got really dark. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go do that. But first, let's go mess with the Venture Company. The Venture Company, um, well, it's kind of what the name suggests. Okay. We'll leave the shredder for, we'll leave the shredder for, oh, it's fucking pan panthers everywhere. Why is there panthers everywhere? Bloody panthers. No, we are going to focus our attention on geologists. Too far away. We'll steal their crystals and then we're gonna sneak into the lumber mill. Open the treasure chest. Then, once we've done that, we're going to find Kozel, kill him, get the blueprints, and then we'll probably be done with the Venture Company stuff. After that, we'll go to Zul Mamwe and tend to all the troll troubles. All right, so you guys are all ranged. Anyway, whilst I go, uh, I'm gonna just uh, quickly speed this up again. Whilst I hunt down all these uh, venture code geologists for their crystals. And uh, I'll see you at the saw blade. Well, looks like we have a bunch of goblins here to take care of before we can safely use the saw blade. There we go, and that actually hurt quite a bit. I mean, it was quite a lot of goblins to fight at once. 
So I'm glad I healed up before I went in. There we go. Okay, now we just need to... Sneak into the apartment, kill the boss, and... Okay, that's the footlocker. Where is he though? Let's see. And do slash target causal. Huh. Where where would he be? Uh-huh. So new plan. Kill him. To obtain this key, but where is he? Requires Causal's key. But where is Causal? Is he just currently not here? Or well, maybe he's up there. That makes the most sense. Let's see. Well, that's it for this week, folks. Fishing contest over. Oh, the fishing contest. Well, why can't I get the broadcast message for that all the way over here? No, oh, you didn't see me. You did not see me. You didn't see me either. There we go. Foreman Causal. Hello. I am here to assassinate you. Claw, snap, yeah sure, go go hide deeper inside, there we go, that was very polite of him. Alright, that's the base camp. Hmm. Sneaky looking human. There we go, fuel regulator blueprints. And now we'll make our way back to Bambala and turn in this round of quests. That shredder appears to... Okay, yeah, that, that was weird looking. Now then... Whoop, whoop. So, what do we got here? Time is money, friend. You got that chest open? I can't wait to see what's inside. What? I, I'm going to have to send this to Flem in the south. You'll know what to do with this. Oh, do you have those crystals? I need them. I mean, I need to know how the evil venture company is losing ground in Stranglethorn. Because, you know, we honest folk have to make a living. Great, wonderful. I I, I can get a bundle of these uh, for these. Uh, the venture company sure picked the wrong jungle to mine in, didn't they? We'd all be in better shape if they moved out of here. Complete the quest. Yeah, quest complete. Or whatever. Greetings, man. The venture company acts against Strangertor and it cannot be forgiven. A fuel regulator. This seems important. At least I hope it is. We may not have ended the venture company's operations, but at least we slowed them down. Thank you, Sir Stay John. Away from and we are leveling up really fast. New, abil new ability available. Thick hide. How does that work? What's that? Passive. Reduces all damage taken by 6%. Ah, that's nice. Uh, let's see. So Zul Mamwe. Oh, wow. That's quite a ways away. Uh, I guess we know what time it is for then. Uh... Oh, fucking panther. Okay, right, so after I take care of this panther, I'm just going to queue up some Warcraft 2 music again. And we're going to get her going. 
Why Warcraft 2 music? Because Warcraft 2 music is lovely. Well, welcome to Zul Mamwe. Time to start hunting. And we start hunting with the hunter. And this panther. Punching panthers everywhere. Right. Extinguishing the braziers. This is annoying. I bet all these hunters are ranged, probably. Oh no, they're not. There we go. Just stack all the bleeds on them and claw through them. Hum nom 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 nom. Hum nom 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 nom. Extinguish another brazier. And, uh. Yeah. Time to just go nuts, run around, and murder a bunch of them. So that's what we're gonna do. Boop, 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 boop. Six percent damage reduction is really making a difference. Got a bunch of interesting herbs. More braziers to turn down. Extinguish, snuff out, whatever you wanna whatever you wanna call it. Time to pop tentacles! Actually, it's barely, barely necessary. I require a target. Making good progress. Looks like uh, Alliance characters also have a quest to turn, that, uh, to turn off the braziers. Okay, we have an assassination target inside here. Yaniku, the envoy of Zanzio. Sansu is creating an army that will wash over all of Strangathorn, Bloodscalp, Skull Splitter, Kurubashi, and Horde. Well, we've trapped him in a soul gem. Clearly, he's being mined. Okay, you guys saw me coming out. I'm sorry. Okay, okay, we need one more, but we also have one other target inside the camp here. So, let's continue our hunt for the other target, which is Badok Big Brain. Let's find Badok. Oh, that's not Badok, but it's a rare. I like I rares. Moch the dead. There's Badok. Well. So yeah, if, uh, if the enemy has a silver portrait, like Moch has here, that means that they're a rare spawn, and that means that they will always drop a magic item. 
like these bracers, which appear to be pretty good. And we've got the brain from Braddock. And we have all the trolls that we need, so we can just go home. So, well, home, go to Bambala. So I'll see you back at Bambala then. Well, we're back. My mother's spirit rests well tonight, Suchoki. As will I. Be seen. Actually, let's go to the Zamlari envoy first. Do you know who I am? I I do. You're you're you are Sir Khan, an emissary of Rastakhan. As promised, your reward, you do the troll nation proud. I pray we chose our allies well. Extra big control spells need extra big brains, yes? Hold on, next part is tough, yes? Lots of chances to fail, yes? But Sulchoki and Sulchoki act Sulchoki Aka going to be reunited. Yes, they will. Mind control very popular, uh, powerful, yes? <laughs> With luck, you can help Ogan Aka escape from Zulguru. Then Ogan Aka becomes Sulchoki Aka again. Speak to Priestess, yes, and help Sulchoki Aka escape. Later. I am ready to for the mind control ritual. Hurala. Bye bye now. And now we are a baby raptor! Whee! You wish to escape? That's fine, but you must know some things first. Stay away from the trolls. They will not kill you, but they will trap you and bring you back here. Speak with every raptor you see. Not only can they teach you new abilities, but they will help you remember your progress and make your path out of Su Group much easier. You already have a dash ability. Use it to get out of tight spots. Oh, and stay out of the water. Good luck. Hmm. Well then. Going to wait a moment. Okay. Uh through here and then dash through oh we were spotted dang it <coughs> ah dang those ones saw us as well man right, this is uh Turning into quite a little mini game. Okay, we have to wait for this patrol to pass. Can't go that way because there's a guard. Across that way. Okay. You are brave to try and escape, young Organ Arca. Before you continue, let me teach you how to use your teeth to bite through trolls' nets. Learn to bite through troll nets from the Elder Raptor. Yay! Use the Eat Through Nets ability to chew through Garubashi nets. Well, that was easy. You are leaving the raptor dens? I was commanded to guard this post to prevent escapes, but I think... I understand why you want to leave. Fine, you may pass, but first, I have a request. The trolls often carry packs of raptor food. I have 
I haven't been fed in days. You don't stand a chance in combat, but you are small enough that you might be able to steal it from one of the sleeping trolls inside the tents. Alright, Tiniju. I'll get you some food for, from the sleeping trolls. Steal food from Gurubashi soldiers. Huh. Inside one of the tents, eh? Okay. Can we get into a tent? Oh. No, 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 no. It that seems like a good tent. To t okay, we'll try a different tent. What about this tent? This tent seems like a good tent. My inventory is full. What? I cannot carry more. Oh. Our bags are full. I should have emptied them out. Oh. Troll was right here. Quickly run back. All the way back along the edge of the wall. There we go. I brought some food for you. Thank you. In return, I will teach you how to distract the trolls up ahead. Learn to light fires. Pick up burning twigs from braziers, then light a fire to burn down Zulka group tikis. Ah. Pop, 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 pop. Okay, let's not head that way. And let's definitely not head anywhere close to those crushers. Those are some big nasty trolls. Wait. Do I not have a torch? Quickly run 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 run. What? No! Dang it! I was caught! Hey. I only have a couple of seconds to burn. So, here I attempt to navigate the latter part of the little raptor minigame. And uh, I decided to also make a couple of edits here because, well, one, frankly, it's embarrassing. Uh, two, um, I cock up more than I would like to admit, which I guess I'm sort of doing right now, is that I'm actually cocking up quite a lot. Um, and I think it might be more fun to watch this bit sped up, even though I am talking during this bit. I am slowly trying to figure out how exactly certain bits and pieces of this mini game work, uh, particularly the bit on the bridges with the skulls that you have trolls trip uh, that's gonna take me a while you'll see what I mean I'll try to make a little uh, collage of some of the uh, some of the action that you're missing but trust me you're not missing that much though it was an amusing little mini game I just don't think it's very um, very great viewing material let's put it like that so Hope you enjoyed uh, this little explanation and this better footage in the background. We'll now be going right back to our scheduled broadcasting where we get arrested by Jindo the Hexer. And we're off! Shade of the Hexer. Where are you going, little one? You're trying to escape from Zugurub? 
Ain't no one gonna escape Zugurub. Not with Jindo in charge. If you're lucky, I don't kill you right now, but I got bigger plans for ya. You see, to summon Haka, I need Mandokia, and Mandokia, he needs you. Hello, Ganaka. Bloodlord, you're gonna take, uh, you gotta take better care of your possessions. Oh yeah, Jindo. We're gonna take real good care of our Ogan Aka. I got a new cage built up. We got plenty of ways to teach her not to escape again. Good, good. And you, yes, you, the meddling worm inside that mind control spell. Don't think Jingdo can't see you. Whenever you got the guts to come back here, you better be ready, cause Jindo's got a surprise for you. Well, I mean. I suppose we'll have to go deal with that later. What a shame, yes? This is what the spirits wanted, yes? Maybe when you are stronger you will go into Zul group and take back your Zul Choki Aka from Mandokir, yes? For now, the priestess give you this. She will give us... a belt. Priestess is not very good at speaking Orkish, no? Maybe you go speak with Surkan upstairs. Tell him about what you've seen inside Zuguru, yes? Report to Surkan at Bambala. Be good. Hmm. And which loa do you bargain with? It would seem that Jindoa has survived and he is rallying his brothers to once again summon Hakar into this world. It was good of you to come and speak with me. There is not much we can do now, but wait and watch. Jindoa is weak and prime for striking. But I must wait for word from Rastakan before, I issue, before issuing orders. Until then, you and your raptor will have to wait. Uh, give my regards to you. Well, fat lot of help you are. But okay, I suppose. Let's get on with saving Yaniku. Take a flight back to Brongol. Relax. Be Sir Chucky, King Wele told me you set out to capture Yaniko. Is it true? Do you have him? You've done it! You freed Yaniko from the will of Zanzil and the tyranny of the Skull Spitter and completed the mission I had thought was so hopeless. Zanzil still looms a threat in the Cape of Stranglethorn, but for now, I at least know that the soul of my chief son is free. Our tribe will remember your name in song, Sir Chucky. And we will etch your tail in stone so that it will live forever. You be careful. Yeah! And on that note, I think we're probably well over time. Who knows? I might have had to cut this into two segments. But for now, this, uh, this was episode 5 of Zul Choki. Uh, it might have been a two-parter. I'll check the footage later. I think next time... Um, next time I think we will go to the Cape of Stranglethorn and go see if we can do something about the Witch Doctor Zanzil. So, um, until then, bye and boop!